I told my friends, I said, I'd be back, but I can't, can't be around you guys and also go where I'm trying to go. Cause I'll only think, walk, talk, act like you guys. If I just hang around you guys, I'm gonna have what you guys have. And I, I came to have something a little more expansive than the current paradigm that we're all living from. And so I told my friends, hey, I know and I love you and I'll be back. But I need to, elevation requires separation. I need to separate myself for a little bit and go on my own journey. I need to walk on my own mountain and figure out who and what I am in this space and in this world. So uh, I'm not saying what you need to do one way or the other, but it is, I'll tell you this, because they, mm, those who were seen dancing were called crazy by those who could not hear the music. You know, you hear the music and they think you're crazy because they can't hear it. They could only see so far because their paradigm had only taken them so far, but they weren't tapped on the shoulder. I was. And when the universe, God, Buddha, Krishna, Jesus, Allah, when it taps you on the shoulder, that is the divine marching orders for what you are to give to this planet at any given moment. And so when you hear it so clearly and turn your back on it based on somebody else's understanding of your marching orders, it is blasphemy to the universe. So for me, when they shared their truth, which was, I think you need to stay acting. There's not much money in that thing you're going after. And what are you going to be, Tony Robbins in four days? Like, of course, it's not going to work like that. Okay, thank you for sharing. And it's not my truth. My truth is, is that I cannot not do this. So I can keep doing it on the side or I could go all in and see what happens. High intention, low attachment. So I disconnected to keep my frequency.